So how did you get into rapping? Did you used to write poetry or? <laughs> no, actually, I had a friend that I used to think he was right. Okay, so running back a little bit. My mom used to be real street, right? Because mm-hmm. growing up in the hood, she was like, huh? She used to have like a tight leash. I ain't letting you go here to go there. Oh, yeah. I used to buy these tapes from like the corner store. They was bootleg tapes. And I would take my money. I always had money. I go buy the tapes. Mm-hmm. But then she'd find them and take the tapes. So, like, <laughs> damn. Right. So, I, you know, I'm not, I couldn't, I was, if I was listening to like anything, especially like Bone Thugs and Harmony, oh, three like six. Oh, yeah, you ain't listening to none of that, right? So, I listen to it, but she take it. So, yeah. my homeboy used to um, rap these Tupac lyrics to me. And he be pretending that he was writing them. And I was listening to everything late. Yeah. I'm still listening to records, really, mm-hmm. when people had tapes right. and CDs. I'm, then I'm listening to tapes or whatever. So I'm behind on everything. And then so, uh, no, I really didn't think he was dope. I just like it because it was the stuff he was picking. I was just like, okay, well, I'm going to write a rap back to this nigga. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And then I started rapping. But then... Um, I always now even before then though like um I won the student council president in elementary and I won that because I remixed the Brett Funkified. Oh really? So I remember when I heard that song, I was like, I want to write that. I want to mm-hmm. rewrite that. Mm. And I did, and I won just because I did that song. I feel like, and then uh, so the Brett, she was an influence. Queen Latifah was an influence. Oh yeah. And then when I heard Mia X, I was like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like, oh, yeah, Mama yeah. Mia. Mama Mia was the number one artist on No Limit. Yeah, so that yeah. was like. that's L- Lyricist wise, anyway. Yeah, that's when that was like my secret oh, hobby. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, she was. Yeah, she yeah, was, was in there. Yeah. I'm like, <laughs> right. My mom <laughs> make me mad. I'm I'm still right. my notebook. <laughs> yeah. I still got some of them old raps. I don't remember them, but I still got them written down. So, so when you was rapping, writing back then, when you writing about, because I said your mama make you mad. So you go in there write real right real life situations in a rap. Yeah. Oh really? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, that's dope. That's yeah. how it always started. You be like, mm-hmm. yeah. And then you know I was responding to whatever he said. So then I was writing things in response to. Oh. So when did you realize he wasn't writing these lyrics? After I heard the song. <laughs> 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 Oh my. Oh, I said you lame, but I really wrote mine though. So. Oh yeah, I'm dope for real. Yeah, for Man, real. You a bite him. <laughs> you out here biting lines. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, you ain't real. You ain't for real. But it, 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 you know, I think eventually, you know, because it impressed him. Like, no, nah, you can write. You know, so it's mm-hmm. like, okay, cool. I really didn't take it serious though until like when I went to high school, we'd be freestyling in the bathroom, stuff like that. What high school did you go to? It's got, it's got, oh yeah, my yeah, bad. Yeah. Cause you know I'm the, my mind is thinking about about, about North Dallas. Oh yeah, no, yeah. I would have went to Hillcrest. Okay, if you I would, would but okay. I went to Skyline. I wanted to take cosmetology. So oh yeah, so they bus from North Dallas too. Yeah. Okay, I didn't know that. Yeah, I, I was really. catching the bus at where was I catching the bus at at TJ. Tom Jefferson. Okay. Yeah, I could have went either there or North Dallas for my home school, okay. <clears throat> but I probably would end up going to Hillcrest. Oh really. It's your girl, Jazzy K with Super Tight TV. We want to thank everyone that's been watching. Hey, if you do us a favor and hit that subscribe button, also press the notification bell so you can be notified every time we drop a new video. No, I'm going to get some game tuned in with Super Tight. Yeah, I get the low love from Big Bobo from the front seat, not no photos. 